What's up, YouTube? What you know? My name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Platinum, our severely randomized Nuzlocke, episode 41. Last time, we went to Lake Acuity and found out that uh, our rival Sam's had just got the crap knocked out of him, and that we were to come here to Veilstone City where we took on the first half of the Galactic HQ. Today, we're going to be finishing that up. If you do have fun during today's episode, hit the thumbs up down below, do subscribe if you haven't already, and make sure to answer the question of the day down below, which is another two-parter. The question of the day is, what is the most relaxing game that you've ever seen and or played? Like when you're trying to just relax, you don't want high, you know, you don't want to get worked up about anything, you don't want to be stressing about much, you just want to relax, what do you play? The reason that's the question of the day is because I was just finished watching several hours of Jay Witz um, playing Stardew Valley and it was just extremely relaxing. During that time I was playing some Digimon Hacker's Memory just grinding another relaxing time. So answer that in the, question there, or in the comments down below and then give me some suggestions for question of the days. I've been talking about how much of a struggle it is. Help me out. Let me know some questions down below. Now let's start off with a team recap. If you were fast, you saw that we've added someone new because someone died last time. First up, we have Friar, the indestructible, our level 46 water fighting type Rapidash holding the wide lens, lacks nature, with own tempo, with Octazooka Spore, Confuse Ray, and Sacred Fire. Next, we have Sholofellow, the first half of our elite squad, level 46 fighting type Tyranitar holding the King's Rock, adamant nature with Sand Veil, with Double Kick, Drain Punch, Earth Power, and Cosmic Power. We have Nadia, the second half of our elite squad, the member that we all voted is going to last the longest. Our level 45 poison normal type Palkia holding the choice band, bashful nature with flash fire, with cross poison, body sam, signal beam, and fly. Next we have Melita, our level, um, Melita the, uh, the sister, no, Melita the flash fire sister, our level 45 ghost type Dawn fan holding the spooky plate. Quirky nature with, oh. Oh no, the other flash fire person died last episode, didn't they? Anyway, we have Melita. I don't have a good creative name, but we have Inner Focus with Shadow Claw, Thunder Punch, Iron Head, and Strength. Then we have Jaya, the God, our level 45 Grass Steel type. Arceus holding the Iron Plate, Quiet Nature with Shell Armor, with Iron Head, Aerial Ice, Rock Ricker, and Leaf Seed. And lastly, we picked him up. We have Sivan, the level 45 water type Mew, holding the splash plate, relaxed nature with soundproof, extremely high special attack, which is why I taught it Bubble Beam. We also have Giga Drain, Hydro Cannon, and Seed Flare. I decided to pick up Sivan because looking through the PC, I didn't really want to do a grinding session right now. Um, and we already had Sivan leveled up, so. That's what we're going with. Now, I should be able to open that door. I guess that's where I go. I like how I open the door and these guys just keep going about their usual. So the most relaxing game for me, like I said, watching Stardew Valley was extremely relaxing, but I don't think I would call that the most relaxing game, at least for me to play, maybe to watch, but, uh, for me, playing Breath of the Wild is easily the most relaxing. We have Spark. I feel like we've had good luck so far with when Octazooka is not very effective, Sacred Fire comes through. But Spark also has the PP and could leave Paralyze. Am I going to regret this? I guess there are more things, I guess. I might regret that. All right, let's try it. See if we're gonna regret it from the first try. It paralyzed on the first try. That validates our, validates our decision. Now, last episode, I had, a, I had a really good ability to call when bad things were gonna happen. And I did that by just being confident and saying positive things about our Pokemon. So everybody sucks. 
Why is everybody learning Spark? I have Thunder Punch. Why would I need Spark? Yeah. That's that's crazy. Why do you have Frenzy Plant? You're gonna stop. Okay. Thank you. I, I'm not ready for Melita. I'm not ready for another Don fan to go down. This music sounds a lot louder than normal. If it is, I'm sorry. It will be fixed by the next episode. I haven't changed anything. Like, nothing has changed. The audio levels are the same. At least in OBS it shows the same. In game it shows the same. I guess let's let's give Savan Oh. Yes, do you say something? Oh. <gasps> you have drizzle. Yeah, you're not going to like that. Okay, Nightshade does does damage for the Okay, that then that's expected. Um, can somebody explain to me why I have 88 hit points? Alright! Warning! Do not get attached to Savan. Do not get attached- and this is for me too. We're gonna get hit by something. We're gonna get hit by something randomly. And it's going to destroy our lives. Ooh, Mystic Water. Now, what powers up more? Is it Mystic... Does Mystic Water power up more? Or does... The Plate power up more? Let's see here. So, I'm going to type Mystic Water. Also, it feels like I'm screaming because the music is so freaking loud. Alright, how much does it power up? Powers up by 20, okay, and then Splash Plate Pokemon. Splash Plate powers up 20. I feel like we should go with Splash Plate just because we have ourselves an Arceus and it's kind of like. I don't, the plates aren't, uh, they're certainly not uh, exclusive to this game, but... Alright, I guess we're here now. Am I gonna let Savan lead? Yeah, I sure am. Because I don't think we battle here. Psst! Here! Over here! This gathering of the Team Rocket! What is the meaning of it? Fellow members of Team Galactic, hear me. My name, as I appear to you today, is Cyrus. This world of ours is a crude one. In a world, in a word, it is incomplete. It has been and always will be a struggle to survive in this world. We humans and Pokemon are likewise incomplete. Because we are all so lacking, we fight, we maim. It is ugly. I hate the incompleteness. That we are, that we are all incomplete. I hate it with my entire body and being. The world should be complete. The world must change. Then who will change it? Me, Cyrus, and Team Galactic. Yes, all of you. Together we poured over myths and exposed their secrets. Together we captured legendary Pokemon. And now Team Galactic has obtained the energy to change the world. The power of dreams is within our grasp. Understand it, fellow members. My long-held dream world is on the verge of becoming reality. All those headed to Mount Cornet and those who remain here. Though our missions may defer, our hearts beat as one. Let there be glory for Team Galactic! Master Cyrus is the greatest! Where did they all go? How did they not see us? Phew! So, that was Cyrus, the boss of Team Rock uh, Galactic. Quite the performance, no? Mesmerizing for one only 27 year old. You're telling me that I could... Okay, sorry. But to make a world for Team Galactic and none other? 
It is preposterous. So much that it makes my head spin. A new world, what is that? And what is this incomplete world? Very well, to investigate such matters is the job of the International Police, of which I am a member in good steed, and it is my job therefore. We shall part ways here. Take extra care, my friend. I don't remember what I'm supposed to do. But how, where did they all go? I'm curious, where did they all go? So you're telling me I have a battle coming up. Never mind. I guess we'll find out where they went in just a moment. Oh yeah, we're not done. Cool, let's go. What did, what did these guys say? Are you enjoying your unescorted, unauthorized, and unsettling tour of Team Galactic HQ? The order's been issued. We, we get pro a promotion if we put you down. Yo! Well, unfortunately for you, you just had... Two really good people. I can't call them elite squad members because Savan is not an elite squad member. Might he be one day? Yes. Is he now? No. That did half. Are we are we serious? I'm scared. If every move does half, we might be in trouble. If every move does half, we might be in trouble. If every move does half, we might be in trouble. Um, so, uh, I might, I might go back and, uh, train up somebody else so that Savan can just sit in the PC and not die. Um, it did take a head smash. I mean, it, it didn't die. Fresh water, that's exactly what I need after that. Jesus. I can't believe it almost just died. It almost just popped. Savan almost was just blown to oblivion. Found another wide lens. Alright, and this one I assume leads me to the back door. No, this is in fact not the back door. And we're gonna show little, uh... So, you've come. You heard my speech, I take it. A big lie, of course. It's true insofar as my intention is to create a new world. But that world isn't for the likes of Team Galactic. I seek an entirely new world solely for myself. If not, it could never be... If not, it could never be the complete and perfect world. You've seen my minions of Team Galactic. You yourself must know that they are uniformly useless and incomplete. I know why you're here. I can sense it in you. It's about Uxie, Mesprit, and Azelf, correct? You want to save them. I no longer have any need for them. I have finished with them. If your heart aches to save them, go right ahead. I couldn't care less. It will save me the trouble of disposing of them. But, I must say... You're a remarkable specimen. Those Pokemon have nothing to do with you, do they? 
but still you came to rescue them out of pity? Such pitifully useless emotions. It is illogical and irrational. Pity and compassion are products of the weak and faulty human heart. You are compelled to come here by such vacuous sentimentality. I will make you regret paying heed to your heart. That was weird. I'm not... Under leveled, under level. Can you imagine if I would have led Mew? He would have. Well, his his uh, special defense is pretty good, so he might have been able to take that. Jolteon, also level 48. Take this. Go, go. Hold on, hold on. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Go, go. Cyrus has the best. Don't, don't, don't even, don't even say it. Wait, which comes first, poison or wish? Oh, you lucky. You lucky. You lucky. You, you can, you have one more turn to fisher me. You know what I just realized? Going in under leveled is not the best, is not the smartest idea. Going in under leveled is not the smartest idea because of things like Fisher, things like Sheer Cold, things like Horn Drill. You wouldn't. Is this the game we're playing? Good thing I didn't just switch into my. Ooh, good thing I switched out, actually. This Jolteon's actually pretty strong. That didn't do a whole lot. I'm gonna lead CG. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Super Fang, whatever. Animations take so uh I'm gonna go for it again. Yeah, it's not gonna do a lot. And I'm going to super potion out of disrespect for you because you suck. Alright, there we go. Level 51. Ho Nelly 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 Ho Nelly 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 Ho Ho Nightshade Does that do 51 to me? Yes it does actually I'm gonna go for the iron head That was a good battle now tell me why Cyrus had a level 51. Tell me why he had a level 51. I see you are indeed strong, and the basis of your power is your compassion towards Pokemon. How wasteful! Such emotions are but mere illusions. And, like all illusions, they fade over time until death banishes them forever. That is why I have abandoned all emotions as useless sentimentality. But that doesn't matter. I doubt you will ever understand my position. That said, I recognize that you are strong and courageous to come alone. This is your reward. Just gives us another Master Ball. The Master Ball is the ultimate Pokeball. It will unfailingly catch any Pokemon in the wild. But it is not anything that I require. Unlike you trainers, I do not make Pokemon my friends or partners. Unlike other Team Galactic members, I, do, I don't use Pokemon as tools. Instead, I make the power of Pokemon my own. If you wish to save the Pokemon from the lakes, take the warp panel ahead. I am off to Mount Cornet. I will send the mountain to its peak where destiny awaits me. It is there that I will create my new world. 
Well. Do we think this guy battles me? That'd be crazy if this guy battled me. Okay. Isn't this... Isn't this where I'm supposed to go? Hold on. He said to take the warp panel ahead. Where does this warp panel take me? Oh! It takes me right here to Thumbnail City. Thank you for that, Pokemon. Hidden items. It's here somewhere. I'm almost sure of it. Never mind. Okay. Well, let's finish up this little this little bit that we have. That was a great battle. You know, it was a little scary. It was a little scary. If we would have led Mew, Savan, that would have been... That would have been horrible. But... Uxie is sealed inside. It appears to be suffering with its eyes shut. Vesprit. And my favorite... Azelf. You! You came all the way here just to save some Pokemon? Though it's nothing new, I can't say I understand our boss. Why would he let a kid like you come and go so freely? We, Tim, Team Galactic, take all that we need and eliminate what we do not. But anyway, you've you've taken the trouble to come. We Let me welcome you. Consider it payback for your insulting me at the lake. Oh! So you want some too. Let's go. I actually wasn't expecting another battle. That doesn't make sense, why it would go one battle straight to the next. Uh, but I'm going to... We're just going to go cross poison. Good, good. Works for me. Good, good. High jump kick was a little scary, but our, st our stats are pretty high. Nadia's stats are pretty high. I wonder if that Psychic would have actually hurt. The thing is, we said Nadia would be the longest to last, but it can still get hit by Oko moves. Because it's not overleveled. Torterra. Oof. The Drizzle. Okay. Okay, that... Supersonic? Yeah, we're switching out. We're not playing. We're not playing. Okay, I'm gonna go into... Jaya's Herd. Let's go into Showa, fella. Okay. Spite? Does that not work if you're not a ghost type? Okay. That was super effective. It's gonna solar beam me. This is the perfect time to get in Sholo fella. Or uh, Jaya. Perfect. Perfect. Alright, let me go ahead and speed this turn up real quick. Citrus Berry. Lol. 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 Alright. That's enough battles for today. Gosh darn it. Ah, what makes you so tough? Fine, do whatever you want with those three Pokemon. 
press the button on that machine to set them free. Who's you? Huh. Saturn and even Cyrus fare to a mere fall to a mere child? Team Galactic's state of affairs is worrying. That plan of Cyrus is a top mount cornet too. Who knows if it will work? Hmm. Perhaps another option needs to be considered. One befitting of the genius of Sharon. Press press the button. I will press the button! Oh, they were gone in a heartbeat. Our boss crafted a red train from a red chain from crystals he took from the three Pokemon. That red chain is what he needed to shackle something on Mount Cornet. It's also apparently needed for creating something. That's all I know. Who knows what he's planning to do up there? Hmm. All right, so Sharon's gonna do something, but I think that's where we wrap up. Actually, let's let's leave this creepy room, and right in front of the G. That's going to wrap up today's episode. Pretty action-packed episode. Uh, and nobody died. We got real, real close to dying. But nobody managed to die, which is good for us. Um, we might still train someone up to take Savan's place. We don't need another water type right now, even though offensively, Savan's would probably be our best Pokemon at that point. Defensively, he has 88 hit points. 88. That's just not going to do it. Um, but anyway, if you had fun during today's episode, make sure you hit the like button down below. And do subscribe if you haven't already. Let's get to this 300 goal as soon as we can so we can keep going. Um, in the next episode, I think we're heading up Mount Cornet, if I remember correctly. So we'll see you then. Until then, spread some positivity, be the light, and have a blessed day.